So here at Maybelline we're seeing a number of different predictions for the coming year and um, some really big themes that are common across all of our clients in different sectors. We've got six different themes which we're predicting, um, one of them being the internet of things. Um, it's becoming ubiquitous the amount of data that's held about us these days, about how much information there is in the background. There's a lot of discussion about whether life's becoming a little bit big brother. Of course mobile phones know exactly where you are, who you are and can combine all sorts of data together. Um, I recently heard Forrester describe it as going more big mother and less big brother. So it's more about convenience and less about creepy. The second theme is about machine to machine. Often when we think about apps we think about the interaction between the human and their device. It doesn't always have to involve the human. Lots of interactions and data intelligence and logic can go on in the background so that consumers are less often distracted so that they can only be involved at the really engaging valuable moments. The third one is data intelligence. Now over the last few years we've seen how demographic data can be overlaid with behavioural, with drill data, with all sorts of different insights about individuals. And what we're also seeing at the moment is a growth in performance back-end data. So companies such as App Dynamics are producing the option for us to build tracking into applications that works out where the web services are failing behind apps, where things can be performing that much better and that much quicker and of course for so many apps, for so many clients in various industries that split second can mean a lot of money. The fourth one is iBeacons, or as we like to call them, my beacons. So we've recently been um, launching a new strand of Moobaloo, which focuses on using this um, BLE um, technology, um, which increases the detection and awareness that's possible around applications. So suddenly, you can be in a location, and the information that you'll be served will be that much more relevant and that much more pertinent to who you are. It's looking pretty powerful, and I think it's gonna be more exciting than ever before. The fifth one is 4G adoption. Not a new one for this year, but something that's really, really growing. Things are getting faster and faster, and with that, user expectation continues to rise. The last one is wearable tech. What will we be wearing a year from now? What will be on our Christmas lists um, later on this year? Um, Wearable tech will be introducing some interesting new conventions, not only around how we behave, but also the OS versions and screen sizes that us as app developers will have to start supporting.